Days after buildings at a Central Kentucky cadet camp were evacuated, new photos are released. A tip led the fire marshal to investigate the conditions of the U.S. Army Cadet Corps facility, formerly the Millersburg Military Institute. Jerrica Ensko talks to a leader of the facility and has the latest. Put the camera down, please. We're on a public street. We're just asking you just reaction about these conditions. That's the reaction we got when we approached Sergeant Brian Linhart at the U.S. Army Cadet Corps with photos inside these evacuated buildings. You're attacking me. I don't think this I is attacking at all. I'm just showing you photos. Despite what the fire marshal in Paris says about the conditions, Sergeant Linhart says Rankin and McIntyre buildings, formerly of the Millersburg Military Institute, were up to code to their knowledge. Do you think that it's safe for the cadets to be staying where there's live wires hanging down in damp conditions? Well, these none of these could none of our cadets were staying in any of these areas that you're showing me pictures. Well, they of. were here though. Yes. But the fire marshal says common sense should have told them that the buildings were not safe. And this is some of the worst conditions I've ever seen. The photos were nothing the sergeant hadn't seen. And when looking through all 21 of them, he still remained positive that the cadets were safe. If you know you're under renovation, why do you have cadets staying in buildings that are under renovation? Because at the time, ma'am, the building inspectors that we've been working with gave us no indication that any of our people would not be safe. The fire marshal has a different story, saying back in 2009, the state advised them not to occupy these buildings because of the unsafe conditions. Reiterated with that again three weeks prior to our arrival on our complaint and advised not to be in the structures. Uh, they chose not to heed those warnings. So what's next? The fire marshal gave them until today to make some sort of progress. If it means that we eventually may have to tear down one of these buildings in order to move forward, then unfortunately we may have to take that step. State officials along with the fire marshal plan to check up on that this Friday. In Millersburg, Jerrica Insco for the Fox 56 10 o'clock news. Child Social Services are also investigating the fire code and safety concerns. Officials with the U.S. Army Cadet Corps say they are waiting to hear their final reports.